Emerks of the water row in Muranga County. Nairobi Governor Mike Muvisungu has weighed in on the issue, launching a scorching attack on his Muranga counterpart, Mwangi Wairia. A visibly angered Sunku told off Wairia over his threats to cut off water supply to Nairobi County. This happened even as the Muranga County Assembly held public participation forums that seems to vindicate their governor. Nairobi Governor Mike Sunku is an angry man. The Nairobi County boss has taken issue with his Muranga counterpart Mwangi Wairia over the latter's recent threats to cut off water supply to the country's capital. Na ule governor natisha tisha atafunga Nairobi maji, amejenga kwa road reserve hapa Nairobi. <laughs> Ukifunga na maji ya Nairobi, hey, my friend. <laughs> But even as the Nairobi governor attacked the Muranga boss in Muranga, the county assembly mobilized a public participation forum over the unending water rows. Kiangalia ukienda hapo ndakaini utaona kitu ya kwanza hata hapo karibu na Dakaini. Dakaini plot center. Yamba damu iko. Unaona ni kama 100 meter na hawana maji hawa watu. Huwa nasubuka sana. Wanashidwa hii Dakaini. Mbona ikajengwa hapa na itusaidi. Such were the hard stances taken by senior members of the water committee moments before getting into the public sitting. The forum was all praises for Governor Wairia, save for few dissenting voices. Si maoni ile ikona upade wa wata inaegemea, lakini kitu ukweli ni kwaba, maji iko juu sana. Na tunauzua bei ya juu, na hata ile boda bayo inategeneza maji. Mimi kama enye ina manage maji. Mimi kama manufacturer, I think I'm uh, nafaa kuwa kama sh, uh, stakeholder. Politics took center stage with some of the members of the county assembly accusing Water and Sanitation Cabinet Secretary Simon Chelugui of interfering with affairs of Muranga County. That is why we are telling Chelugui to namambia, please, with due respect, mabo ya kusema sijui ndakaini, landi ya ndakaini ilinunuwe, hiyo tsai kuongea sana, lakini ya jue, Meanwhile, Muranga Water and Sanitation Company Managing Director Daniel Nganga now says that the company is ready for dialogue to solve the impasse. This is an issue that uh, 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 the company, the companies are ready to another stakeholders to sit down with the office of the county government and look at the issues that, are, that, that have caused all this disturbance. At the center of the water row is the hurting residents of Muranga County who have severally taken to the streets over the matter they hope will be resolved promptly. Divergent views in today's public participation is a clear indication that the water scaffold here in Moranga County is far from over. This even as we wait for the governor, Mwangi Wairia, to appear before the Senate Departmental Committee on Water anytime now. Reporting for KTN News, my name is Ibrahim Karanja. All right, let's cross over to Muranga County and listen in to what the members of the county assembly have to say because I understand right now they are addressing members of the press. Yesterday, C.S. Uh, talked of water being a natural resource. It is a natural resource. Oil is not a man-made resource. It is still a natural resource. So what we are saying, we must get a share from that water and we don't want any diversion whatsoever. On, 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 on the, the, the water issues uh, across either, either, either from, uh, from the political side or from, from the CS. So we want to tell Governor Sonko that he should keep off from the, from the water issues and they must limit some uh, percentage for water levy that is going to Nairobi. Governor Sonko yesterday said uh, the governor, Mwangi Wairia, has built on a road reserve and he said the moment he is going to disrupt the Ndakaini supply of water, uh, Sonko is going to demolish that building. What's your response to that? Okay, thank you very much. I think uh, he, is, he is used to to to, uh, to put some, some, some it, it's, it's like he is trying to, to instill some fear to the readers and to the people. Whenever you comment on something and we are fighting you for your people, now he brings some threats that, that we are going to do this and this and this. Now that is a theatric uh, uh, comment. And we are not cowed by, by, by such deaths. So even if I have a building in the CBD, let him go and demolish that building. If that, if that, will be, if that cost 
uh, will be meant to pay for people to get water in turn, then let him do. Because uh, cause, uh, ours, we are fighting for the right of our people, and we are not going to, sp to stop it. As we, are, as, we are, as we have said, we are not stopping it soon. We have to fight for our people to get water, and that levy must be paid to our people of Muranga. Uh, thank you very much. I'm Stephen Chege, uh, Chairperson Youth Committee. I also want to condemn what Governor Mike Sunko said yesterday. And uh, I want to say clearly that Sonko had shown that uh, uh, in his demolitions planned, he is using the demolition as a tool to silence leaders who are uh, trying to defend their regions. We all right, uh, members of Muranga County Assembly responding toward Nairobi County Governor Mike Mubisonko had to say yesterday concerning that water row in Muranga County. We continue keeping a keen eye on that development.